Uh, just didn't pitch good. Uh, it feels fine. Just, just right now, just trying to just trying to find it. Just grinding. Obviously, I mean, you guys are watching. I'm struggling. I don't know if I've ever pitched like this in my life. So, um, you know, a tough spot to be in. But you know, I got guys in here fighting, and I got to keep fighting. I mean, there's no there's no giving up. You know, when something's not working, you got to go to something else. When that's not working, you go to something else, and I'm trying to find something. You know, I'm I'm working. I know. That only goes so far. This isn't you know, the hard work league. This is a do good league. So um, you got to start going out there and performing. What's your biggest issue: command and execution. Would you say? Yeah, just not putting away uh, you know hitters when I have the opportunity to. Um, yeah, obviously, some balls found some holes today, but at the end of the day, it's you give up hits, you give up runs, you're going to lose games. You know, we score five runs. We had six guys come out of our bullpen. They only gave up two runs. So. Um, you know, we got to win that game. This is very easy to just throw on top of the pile and say we're not playing good. This wasn't us not playing. This was me sucking today. And that's frustrating because today was the day we were going to turn it around. You know, we're back home, ceremony in front of our home fans, playing our first home game. Uh, everyone did what they had to do except for me, and that's 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 a frustrating spot to be in. Do you feel like it's the same thing every day, or that you're kind of something you're tired of? I mean, if I knew what it was, I'd you know I'd, I'd fix it. You know, that's kind of where I'm at. It's spinning my tires. I'm looking at this, looking at that, I'll see if I'm tipping pitches, see if my mechanics, if it's this, if it's angles. It's, you know, I'm still searching, but, you know, I'll, I'll find it. I know who I am. I know what I can do. I've been there before, and I'll keep grinding. Never in my life, but that's not going to stop me. I don't I don't have an inch of back down in me. I, I never will. I'll never give up. I've just got to keep fighting. Like I said, I... It's only going to go so far here, you know. You don't care if you're trying hard. Like I said, we got, I got to start perf performing and putting zeros up and, and winning games, and that's that's what I'm prepared to do. Chris, are you working through anything? Any, any arm issues? Any arm strength all right? Yeah, everything's fine. I'm just, like I said, I'm just not getting it done. That's that's the bottom line in, in this game. That's the bottom line in sports. Never seen an ugly win and never seen a good loss, so. At the end of the day, it's just got to find a way to win, no matter what. No, I mean it was it was awesome. I I watched it inside. Um, this a like I said, this was a special day. Um, just wish I could have helped it out a little bit more. It was it was really cool though. You know, our fans showed up to support us and, and celebrate with us and. Um, it was an awesome moment, but at the, at the same time, I you know I was trying to get prepared to go win a ball game. How nice is it, Chris, that you go to some morning like this and you see, you know, David Ortiz, Manny Ramirez, Pedro Martinez, and then Gronk and Patriots coming out there too. It's special. You know, like I said, today was a today was a special day. Um, you know, it just shows the support not only our past players in this organization have for us, but uh, players in other organizations of, you know around the city. So. Um, you know, you knew that going in. Obviously, this is a this is a sports town, and and we take a lot of pride in, in in the sports that we play here. So it's just nice. You know, today was today was a really good day, other than when uh, when the lights flicked on. How about yourself? Now, do you go to uh, the physical part of it out in the bullpen and try to get it that way? Work, look at mechanics. What kind of things do you kind of go through before your next start? Uh, I'm just going to cover all the bases. You know, just try to talk to. Dana and, and Danny and CB and, and, and see what we got. I mean, like I said, I'm I got a lot of work to do. So luckily, we got an extra day this week to to get a little bit more work in. But um, I got to find something. I better find something. Out of the funk. Well, like I said, man, this this wasn't a team being in a funk today. Like I said, we scored five runs. We had half a dozen bullpen guys throw. Um, Today was on me. You know, today was supposed to be. We were supposed to win today's game. You know, we score five runs in a day that I start. We got to win that one. So um, I wouldn't exactly say today was a team funk day. Today was just me not being who I needed to be. There's a lot of a lot has been made of that. It's been a lot of build up for the starting pitchers. You guys didn't pitch a lot in spring. Where do you feel strength wise, health wise? 
I feel fine. I'm, I'll never sit here and make excuses. I'm, I'm a starting pitcher. I've been doing this long enough. I should be able to <laughs> wake up on Christmas Day and throw strikes. You know, it doesn't matter what the circumstances are, if it's this or that or spring training. I, I got to find a way to get it done. You know, there's there's no excuses to that. I just I got to be better. Like I said, I just flat out have to be better. Yeah, that was that was a little different. I was geared up to throw a slider, saw that he took off, tried to kind of regrip it, and just kind of pushed it the other way. Um, part of it, you know, you got to be got to be prepared for that.